Okay, so you have a cup of sugar, two tablespoons of flour, and how much salt? A fourth of a tablespoon. Fourth of a tablespoon. Okay, fourth of a well, teaspoon. That fourth of a teaspoon. Yeah. And mix. Fourth of a teaspoon. Yeah. Yeah. Then I gotta get up. There you go. This is apple pie spice. And you get a half a tablespoon of that. Now stir that all up. And this is what's mixed with the apples when I put them in the, oh, okay. in the pan. This is for the kids. Okay. That's that part of that. You go to this here. And I got a two cup thing. Okay. And it takes I fill that up real good. Okay. And you notice my my surface. Okay. And this is all purpose flour. Okay. That's what I use. And that's the recipe that I got it out of. It said two, two, two. you have to sift it twice. Oh, you have to sift it twice. Yeah, I'll show you. So when did you decide you was going to be a pie baker? I can't even remember. You can't, how long have you done this you've been for? <laughs> oh, just a short time. I, since Seal came hard, I don't really do things anymore. Why? I, I do it. Oh, good. She could do it, but... Uh, okay, so what are you adding now? And this is salt again, and another fourth of a teaspoon. You put it in there on top of it. Then I sift that again. I guess it mixes up pretty good when I sift it. And I use a bigger bowl than I need to, because I like to, it's kind of, it's a lot easier to blend it. Yes, I'm sure it is. And this is for the pie crust now. Is that what you're making? That's the crust, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, this is the crust. That's that. Okay. Now, takes the Lord. And I've already... I've already... <coughs> Cut the lard. It's, it's in, a, it in a box like that. Okay, okay. And then I cut it in, in this thing right here. But if you ever need me to cut some for you, I'll do it. So okay, okay. You've got that, a that special... That splits it to thirds, see, a third yeah. of a pound. Okay. Did you make that? Huh? Did you make that device? Oh, yeah. I made a cut one. Mm -hmm. So it's one third of a pound. Yeah. One third of the bar. Well, I think that's supposed to be a pound, isn't it? I don't know. One, one third of, yeah, it's a pound bar, so one third. Uh-huh. That would be one third of a pound. Yep. Place that on the flour. Then you got to go to work. And boy, you took that right out of the refrigerator, so it's hard. 
Oh yeah, yeah, I like I like it cold. And I already washed my hands. That's okay. Of course. Yes. yes. Now you just take that the, the <coughs> lard out of the box and drop it in there. And leave the paper on it. Uh huh. Push it down in there, and then just take a knife and cut those. This takes a while, so yeah. Okay, I'll stop this. Okay, well, it's how long do you do that? Well, you do it until it comes out. Of, <laughs> the recipe says it's supposed to be about like coarse cornmeal. Okay. But mine don't look like that. I never saw cornmeal look like that when I do it. <laughs> it takes a little while. To She don't know how to do it. She watches me from the big chair in there. Hmm. <laughs> no, she peels the apples for me. Well, that's good. Lots of times. Yep. Yep, well, I think we got that good enough. Now, I've got to get water. And this is a touchy thing. All right. This is what you got to have. It's got to be so, uh, so moist, you know, and it can't be too dry. Yeah. So you just have to kind of guess it, what you're going to put in, according to what the humidity is in the house, I really think. Okay. Six tablespoons of water. <clears throat> What's your favorite apple to use? Jonathan. Okay. If you can get them, you can't this time of year. But you froze some, or huh? did you freeze some, or you still? No, no, I didn't. Uh -uh, no. What kind are we using today? They're uh, these are. Uh, I think they're uh, uh, John of Gold. John of Gold. They don't have much flavor. That's the problem. So are you looking for any specific consistency to that? Yeah. You just kind of practice it. <laughs> it's got to come out so sort of roll out good and uh, and pick up all the flour. I don't know. Never seems to come out exactly the same for some reason or another. Hmm. Well, I know that it's better than the ones you buy at the store. Absolutely. <laughs> it's good exercise for your hands, Willis. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty touchy. Nobody seems to like it. Women don't like to make pie crust for some reason. I know they I don't. I don't know what it is. I know they don't. I, I know that. I don't mind. 
My mom didn't mind it. No, and mine either. Yeah. What kind? Pie crust. Just women don't like to make pie crust. Oh. Oops, my work. Tyrant's hands. Then you go take about, divide that thing up in five parts and you take about two fifths for your top. Okay. And three fifths for the bottom. I don't know, that's a guess. I don't okay. know. Okay, okay. I don't know. Any. So you, you're making the bottom first, I assume. No. No? This will be for the bottom. <laughs> You like to get it in a perfect ball. Okay. With no creases in it, if you can possibly do it. Mm -hmm. Then it rolls out nice. I don't know why I'm telling you all this. I don't know anything about it. I really. like it. I like it. <laughs> I really don't know anything no. about it. I just I just do it. Uh -huh. Liz, did you want me to peel apples? Yeah, sure. Here comes Lucille's share. <laughs> yeah. Move your stool over there and settle on it, see?